Yeah, okay. Alright guys, sorry about the confusion. Both players were told they were going to So you have to explain anything on stream, just tell them that we sat them. They, they stepped, our starting hands are exactly the same, and yeah. they're, they're just doing that. Yeah. Alright, we're good guys. So they're starting. It is not Madison, Corey. That is Donnie. Now we're in round four, guys. Sorry about that. Update the title. Round four. Beautiful. All right, so again, this is an ABC mirror. Both deck lists are pretty similar. Mike Sanders did not find a way to put Skarm or BLS in this deck. Yeah, I know. I do apologize about the glare. It's the only place we could put the table, I believe, unfortunately. Why are you a fiend, Josh? I thought you were a nice guy. Grandma's like Bless you, guy outside the box. <laughs> Jesus! Alright, so Suki, is this is that a Suki Omi? I think it is. And the Gamma Sill. Also play with world sleeves. Well, I did. Not anymore. They were starting to starting to die. And looks like that was the rip of a gamma cell and a spell card. I think it was a twin twister. I also have a lot of troll decks made. I 
Hexaton would be awesome right now. And game one goes to the Mike Sanders. Built? No. Save decks that are built, like dev pro decks that are troll decks? Infinite. Yo, the goo I have right now building up is the best. It's the best goo you've ever had. Yo, so Giovanni lost last round, Mike, so you get to pop his tires. Is that Mario banging on the door? Skarms out for Sanders, everybody. Just pull your Skarms out for Sanders. What do you mean, two fusion dragons? You mean the... The big ABC dude? No, he's playing three big ABC dude. Sideboard-wise, Sanders has two copies of Ref Panel. Pretty funny if you ref panel a desire. What? I feel like it's Mario standing outside my box. He was knocking on it. Sanders is definitely putting in the three Ghost Reapers for sure. Donnie's putting in his two Ghost Reapers, I'm, I'm sure. Ghost Reaper just seems good. Two starting, they've presented and cut each other's decks, and we will see who's going first. I'm assuming you want to go first in this matchup. Be safe, Josh. Take care, bro. Be
There is a vanity's emptiness. Oh, baby. Is it possible to bring back the vanished ABC Buster Dragon to extra? I don't think so. You can always burial from a different dimension and then emerald them back. I mean, that's a long route to do one thing. In order to do what I said, you'd have to run Mario. Technically, you're not supposed to reposition your spells and traps. It's not game possible. Unless you're playing cards that purposely require something. But in that case, pretty sure it's a different story there. We're not here to harass the judge staff, though. That'd be, be brutal. Every time somebody moved a spell or trap card. I like that Lee has his own surrogate. tell which one was equipped. The glare makes it almost impossible to tell. I don't think 
system down destroys them, though. I think it just removes them from play. But doesn't that one of them? One of them protects them from spells. Hold on. Catch it. It's on him. Actually, the first game three we've had in four rounds for stream. scramble in his hand. Tony's got a pretty interesting hand. Pretty sure you start by specially the thrash. Check out 
silver gadget. If this card is just being destroyed by a card effect, it does get the effect. I was reading a card, I missed what happened. Did he... I can't tell if he specialed another gadget or not. I think he did, right? Yeah, so he special summoned gold. Looks like gold. So what's the cheat? It depends what the if he's yeah. So if he warning the summon. So the part that they're talking about is that you can only use only one of the gadget effects per turn. So if he activated the effect to special the gadget, then he would not get the effect to special one from the deck. But Sanders misplayed and specialed the summon of the gadget instead of... I'm in the same building as them. I don't think that it's it's a Mike Sanders thing. He's kind of got to let it. If he knows what he's doing, he knows what he's doing.
because he didn't play any Skarms in his deck. card in the middle of the glare is the Yu-Gi-Oh card. Sanders just looks like he's having tons of fun right now, right? Sometimes you're just not meant to win. Yo, I think I want to thank all you guys that are tuning in right now and watching. I know the ABC mirror is kind of boring to watch, especially when there's a lot of misplays, miss sighting. Monster with the glare is, I'm not sure. It is, looks like an XYZ. Might be a Geary Gun, could be Rebellion. More than likely Rebellion. Oh, chat got me. Chat, thank you. What does Sanders do here? Not much, right?
hangar would be really good if you had a play for it. I don't know what his face down is, I forget. There's a system down. Is that the same one that they keep letting die? Or am I seeing things? Something I'm missing is why either of them or not. Yeah, I don't understand it either. Hold on. I'll go tell him. Judge on the scene. We got it. There we go, guys. We had a judge on the premise. We Gucci. Yes, it was corrected. System now played never happened. He didn't cherry? Oh god. So what happened was the system down just goes back into his hand. At least that was what, what was happening when I left the table. Is the game state rewinds. Oh, he set the cherry? See, I stepped outside for a second. Yes, he already activated it. I do not believe... I don't know why it would rewind though, thinking about it. Watch is unaffected. Whatever, judge handled it. I would assume so, that there's machines in the graveyard. Judge handled it how the judge handled it. There's nothing.